most of the work that I do is what I would consider visual art, either rooted in painting and illustration or graphic design. Mostly creating graphics and illustrations inspired by my youth, which is driven by a lot of skateboarding, hip hop, graffiti, comic books, and things that initially inspired my love for art and creating when I was younger. My name is Matt Corrado, and I'm a visual artist and designer. So a normal day, usually I'm here at our studio at Bright Light, and we consider ourselves sort of a full-scale creative agency. It really enables me to work on a lot of different creative outlets at the same time, which has really kind of always been the way that I like to work and, you know, what allows me to kind of feel like I'm expressing all the different creative uses that I have going on inside. For me, I really actually enjoy going back and forth between different mediums. So I really like the balance of being out on a project, using my hands, climbing on ladders, being really tactile and in the environment, you know, there's traffic, there might be construction or there might be rain, you know, have, you have all these different elements that affect the work and I really enjoy that. So most recently, I've been focusing a lot of time on large-scale mural projects and really perfecting the, the process and getting those really down to where I'm doing a lot of those projects each year. For larger projects, it's definitely harder to do by myself. So it's nice when, I, when I'm able to bring on people to assist and, and help make the projects move faster. White, blue, white, so maybe like... Once we're kind of in the process of installing, it's really just work, work, work until we, you know, get to a point where we're done and the, the project is ready for the client to review. I kind of enjoy that time of like filling in the paint or doing the mundane part of it because that's really getting those 10,000 hours. Like that's where you're perfecting the craft. I really just value people that have put in the time and the effort to get their skills to such a place where people are like, how long did that take? Because that that's like, to me, kind of the ultimate compliment. Creativity to me is kind of thinking outside of the box or, you know, just thinking about things from a different angle and using kind of real world experience to try to solve problems. I think ultimately, you know, creativity to me is about solving problems. I would say I definitely have an emotional connection. I mean, I put a lot of work in and I care tremendously about the work that I do. You know, I'm always working. Even if I'm not working on something, my brain is still thinking about it or I'm, I'm thinking about the, you know, a new idea or I'm seeing inspiration somewhere. It's really an all day, you know, immersive thing always that's kind of happening. Painting murals, designing logos and branding, and working on digital media stuff, and working with a team of other creatives. So there's so many different things that makes it super interesting. It's just that there's never really a dull moment. The most fun projects are always the ones that I'm a little bit nervous about, or the projects that I have never done before, but I say yes to. For me, it's just important to keep pushing and to keep trying to be better and not get stagnant and keep learning and keep being curious and keep putting yourself out there because you really never know what opportunities might come up next. <laughs>